Hi guys, welcome to my first vlog about food and the cheapest budget ones which are as good as the most expensive one. I'm going to show you throughout my channel the best prices of the cheapest soups, biscuits, etc. So if you want to come along and see for yourself and just don't think, oh it's cheap. No, replicas, okay. But this, today, what I've discovered is this soup, M&S, cup of soup from M&S, just under a pound, working out 25 pence per packet. So I'm going to do it today. I'm going to show you what it is. It's in a packet. The, there's all the ingredients, carbs, saturated fats, whatever. If you can have a look there. So it's in a good box, just as much as the bachelor one, the good one. What's quite, it's double the price of this, right? So the comparison here, which I am so terrible thinking, I want a cheap one, I want this, I don't want this, I want this, I want it to taste nice. But, but this, honestly, is fantastic. So I want you to try it, but I'm going to do it today. I'll just show you, right? No boiling water, whatever pans. What are we going to do? Just one cup, like you would make a coffee, right? So here's my cup, here's my packet, right, water on the boil, just like you was going to make a coffee or a cup of tea, right, so I'm going to put this off, okay, put it into my cup, all gone. Honestly, let's try this, guys. It's really good. Right? Let's get off the boil. What I do is just pour a little bit at a time. Just so it's like a paste. Okay? Like this. And then you don't get it all stuck at the bottom. Just get it like this. Stir. Make sure it's not on the bottom. Keep adding the water. Bit by bit. Like this then it doesn't go all lumpy. So you do this just like you would with any other cup of soup. soup. Sorry. Sorry about the mistakes. My first channel. First film. First vlog. There you go. It's getting thicker and thicker. But it depends on how you want it, preference, really. But I like it not too thin. Not too thin. I like it more thicker, but not too watery. There we go. It's getting... Done like that now, a bit more water. As I said, it's to your own preference how thick you want it. There you go. Keep stirring, just for a second then. The consistency there is still kind of thick. And guess what you could add? Croutons to it, coriander, anything you want for the topping. Just to kind of give it that bit more flavour. Also, what I usually do is get a baguette, cut it, put it in squares. You don't need, you don't, um, you don't need any croutons. So you get some bread, you know, the baguette, and just have it. And I tell you, on these winter evenings, this is all you need. I used to make soup in a pan, vegetables putting up all day, and honestly, leave, you leave it on the pan, on the cooker, for about hours. Smells all your house out the soup. If you don't want that, just have this quick and cheerful. Then, when you've done this, sit in the tower with your bread, and it's so filling. It's all you need on winter evenings. You know what? Oh, the smell is horrendous. It's lovely. It smells like tomatoes. Fresh tomato. It smells beautiful. Also, it smells good. Right, I'm going to taste it now. Okay. lovely honestly really nice soup i was i would say if it's ugh, it's not like heinz or bachelor soup that to me is honestly 10 out of 10 so why don't you try it m s it's under a pound 
try it let me know and tune in for some more vlogs about food put right okay i'll put everything below the bottom so if you like it press that bell the notifications and guess what i'll bring you more thank you enjoy